Welcome to the My Compass PA mobile app demonstration video on how to upload documents using My Compass PA. There are times when an individual needs to submit documents for an application they've submitted or for currently active benefits. Traditionally, the individual must mail or take these documents to the county assistance office. Through the mobile app, a user can upload those documents and submit them directly to the county assistance office. To upload documents, the user will first tap the Documents button on the menu. The Document Center will open. The user sees an Uploads in Progress section at the top of the screen because they began the upload process, didn't finish it, and are now returning to upload their documents. If the user has outstanding documents that the County Assistance Office requested, along with a posted date, they will see a card in the Requested Verification section of this screen. When the user taps the arrow to the right of the card under the Requested Verification section, a PDF version of a notice indicating what documents they need to submit will appear. On that screen, the user would have the option to upload documents. Upload functionality will be addressed in a moment. After reviewing the requested verifications, the user taps the Back button in the upper left of the screen. The Document Center screen appears. The user scrolls down to the Uploaded Documents section. In this section, they can see documents that they submitted in the past 180 days. The user can tap the arrow on each relevant card to view a PDF version of the document that they submitted. This user taps the first arrow. The previously uploaded document appears. If the user would like to do so, they can tap the Share button to share the document in various ways, for example, to an email, or to a printer if installed. After reviewing the document, the user taps the Back button to return to the previous screen. On the Document Center screen, the user taps the Upload Documents button at the bottom of the screen. Please note that the user can only have one upload in progress at a time. If the user tries to start another upload before finishing the current upload in progress, a pop-up will appear and inform the user that they must either continue the upload already in progress or start over. The user taps the Start Over link. The pop-up closes and the Document Upload screen appears. Here, the user can tap the relevant application or open case that requires document submission. All options function the same way for uploading documents. For purposes of this demonstration video, the user will upload documents for an open case by first tapping the case card under the relevant cases. On the screen that appears, the user can tap the document type that they would like to upload. Please note that if the user were to tap Other or Not Listed, they would be prompted to provide a description. Here, the user taps the ID card in the top left of the screen. The screen that appears will allow the user to either take a photo by tapping the green Take a Photo button, or by tapping the blue Gallery button and selecting a photo from a folder either on the device or a location to which it is connected, for example, cloud storage. Near the top of the screen, the user sees some tips for taking a photo. Those tips include, take it in a room with a lot of light, hold your phone directly over the document when taking it, and review it before submitting to make sure it isn't blurry. These are important to ensure that the County Assistance Office can view and read the document submitted. The user taps the Take a Photo button. The device's camera app will open, allowing the user to take a photo of the item they wish to upload. After the user takes the photo, they can review the quality of the image. They can either tap the Retry button to retake the photo, or they can tap the OK button to use the photo they've taken. The user taps the OK button. On the screen that appears, the user will see a prompt informing them that the document is ready to be saved. They will also be asked if there are more pages to the document. The user can tap the Add Another Page button to take photos of additional pages, or tap Save Document if there are no additional pages. Please note that the user can also decide to remove a page of the document by tapping the red trash can below the image. This user taps the Back button in the upper left of the screen. A pop-up appears, which states, You have not saved your document. Are you sure you want to cancel? The user can either tap the Cancel button to stop the document upload, or they can tap the Continue link to close the pop-up and continue with their document upload. The user taps Continue. Back on the Document Upload screen, 
the user taps the Save Document button at the bottom of the screen, and a pop-up appears that reads, Ready to save your document? You won't be able to add any more images. At this point, the user can tap Save to save the document, or tap Cancel to return to the previous screen. This user taps Save to continue with their document submission. The Documents in this submission screen appears. Here, they will see the documents ready to be submitted, along with the number of pages in each document. If the user has more documents to submit, they can tap the Add Another Doc card, which this user does. The Document Type Selection screen appears. To demonstrate how a user can upload a photo that is already on their phone, they will add another document. This time, the user taps the Proof of Citizenship card. Again, the Document Upload screen appears. The user will tap the Add Another Page button. They will be prompted to either take a photo of the document or select an image from their device's gallery. This user decides to select an image already on their device. They tap the Gallery button at the bottom of the screen. Their mobile device's gallery opens. Here, they tap the document they wish to upload. On the screen that appears, the user will see a prompt informing them that the document is ready to be saved. Please note that the user can once again decide to remove a page from the document by tapping the red trash can below each page. They can tap the Add Another Page button to upload additional pages from their gallery, or tap the Save Document button at the bottom of the screen if there are no additional pages. This user taps Save Document. A pop-up appears that reads, Ready to save your document? You won't be able to add any more images. The user can once again tap Save to save the document, or tap Cancel to make any changes to the document. This user taps Save to save the document. They return to the documents in this submission screen where they will see documents ready to be submitted. At this time, the user is ready to submit their documents. The user taps the Submit button at the bottom of the screen. The user will see a success screen informing them that their document successfully submitted and that changes may take 7 to 10 days to appear in their account. The user taps the Back to Document Center button at the bottom of the screen. On the screen that appears, they tap the Home button in the App menu. The app returns the user to the dashboard. Thank you for watching this My Compass PA mobile app demonstration video. Please note that links to all My Compass PA demonstration videos appear in the video description below. Have a great day.